Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. Somebody emailed me, underneath your text tool is your table tool. As you see, it's gonna draw two squares by four squares. And if you hold down the control button, at least you get a square. But they wanted to draw four square by four square. Well, one, you could make that four square by four square, and then hold down the control button, and you get four by four. But they wanted it, well, that's only two by four. Um, you can change this to four. And now you get four by four. No, can't do it that way. Anyway, you can, you can change it now and change your whatever you want. So now you got four by four. But to change it where it'll happen every time, you have to go to tools, options, and tools. And right here on the table, yours is going to look like this when you open it up. Go to table, set this for four. And then I would save it as default if all your other parameters are right. We'll go to tools and save as default. And I'm going to do it because I kind of like that four by four look. So now, even though it says two by two up there, it's drawing four by four. And then every time you draw, it'll draw four by four, which is pretty cool because then you could, you could make this uh, 16 inches by 16 inches. 16 inches by, and so each in, each square should be four inches. And I've never really used the table tool with the exception of a couple of times to, to uh, put a picture into it. And uh, you can go up to object and, well, let's, we gotta select it, go up to object and break the table apart. And then you could actually break it up further Ungroup them, and then you got individual line. Pretty neat way to draw some name tags and save you a lot of cutting. But anyway, I hope that answered their question and thank.